this video, I, do, I wanted to do a little update about the trim tool. Uh, the um, trim command has recently changed after so many years. Uh, it used to be where you had to choose the, there was a two-step process, choose the cutting edge and then choose the part that you want to trim off with. But finally, like most pieces of software, they've simplified that command significantly. So with the trim tool, go up here in the, it's in the modify toolbar, click on trim. And basically, if you just hold down your left mouse button, you can wipe it across whatever it is that you want to get rid of, or you can choose it. So it's kind of really easy just to hold down your mouse button and trim so much better, so much quicker, much more efficient way. And that's how you'll find with most CAD software these days is the trim tool is uh, greatly improved. So that's great. It makes your life a little bit easier. Also, in a similar vein, if you look at the underneath trim, so go up to your modify tool under trim, you have your extend tool that also has been improved, or again, you used to have to choose a target where you wanted to extend to. Now you just have to choose like the end of the line. Now be careful because uh, you can't choose too far near the middle because the software will be confused Did you want to go right or left. So if I wanted to extend it to the left, just move your cursor closer to the left end. If you click on that, it would extend it that way. Likewise, extended here, so the difference is uh, really amazing. It's so much better now. You could even extend a circle if you had a partial circle, which is kind of an unusual circumstance, but the tool works the same. So hopefully it helps. So AutoCAD 2022 does have improved commands for both trim and extend.